Welcome to this course on machine learning for molecules. I am Vinayak Bhatt, the creator of Chemistry with Code and instructor for this course. In this course, we'll delve into the fascinating AI revolution and its intersection with chemistry. We'll see how these powerful machine learning tools can be used to accelerate research in chemistry. This course is designed for students with expertise in chemistry and some basic knowledge of coding in Python. In this course, we'll discuss a variety of topics which include molecular representation, artificial neural network, supervised learning, but we'll do all of this in a conceptual manner and not dwell a lot into the mathematics behind it. This course will be a lot of hands-on experience on training machine learning models and looking at the results from them. The outcome for this course is you'll have basic understanding of machine learning concepts. You'll be able to gather data for training and transform that data to train machine learning models. And you'll also be able to validate the performance of those models. At the end of this course, you should be able to create your own machine learning pipeline to do predictions on molecular structures and see how you can accelerate your research in, in the field. This is a four day uh, course and on the first day, we'll look into the basic concepts without too much of math. And we'll see how we can gather data for molecules and train classical uh, machine learning models and then validate the result. On the second day, we'll look into uh, neural networks and the basic concepts, again, with not too much of math, and then train neural networks, validate the results, see how good the neural networks trained are, and also explore some graph-based models on uh, predicting molecular properties. On the third day, we'll see how to code the neural networks. In, in the first two days, we'll just use readily available machine learning models and train them. But on the third day, we'll look at how to change the code, how to modify the neural network so that we can generate new neural network architectures and train the model on our problem. On the fourth day, we'll see how we can use pre-trained models that others have uh, trained and you can use them to uh, predict whatever molecular property you want to predict. We'll see some hyperparameter tuning and running the code on GPUs and also some tips on training on uh, high, high performance computing resources. All of this will be in uh, a pre-recorded like video just, just as you see this one, but there will be live sessions of approximately 30 minutes on day two, three, four, and it will be at 10 a.m. Eastern time where I'll be reviewing some previous day material and you'll have time to ask me questions or get some help with the code that you're struggling with. I hope you'll find this course helpful and at the end of this course you'll be equipped with the skills needed to train your own machine learning models and accelerate your research. I'm excited in, to work with you in this course and I look forward to seeing you again.